and welcome back to winemastery.co.uk. My name is John Lightfoot, this is... John Murphy. And we're here to tell you all about wine. Hopefully help you find the wine. If not the wines, you will absolutely love. Oh, it's beautiful, John. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Hopefully we're going to find some wines that when you swirl the glass around, the flavours, the smells will waft up into your nostrils and they'll be so, so drawing like a magnet. You just have to have a sip of that gorgeous smell. And then you're tasting around your taste buds, swirling around your mouth, and everything will be fine in the world. <laughs> <laughs> well, you all right, John? Have you been, have you been thinking already? What, what was that? Very... Well, well, this is a very special, very, very special um, episode, isn't it? Because it's the ones I really enjoy. Oh, yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a budget episode. <laughs> <laughs> he looks forward to these. He looks forward to these. <laughs> so this is where we've been looking. If you look previously in some previous uh, episodes, we've been looking, tasting some beautiful uh, Pinot Noirs from around the world. And this time uh, we've gone shopping and just look for those that are on a really, really good price to see if it is possible to get a good Pinot Noir for around a fiver. Mm -hmm. So the first one we're kicking off with, which we haven't actually tried um, in terms of uh, in previous episodes, is a French one. It is indeed, yes. Now French wine is known as being very classy. Indeed, yeah. Or as they say in the north of England, classy. That's how I'd say it, yep. Not how I say it, Obviously. <laughs> <Off it. laughs> <Off it. laughs> <laughs> oh, <dear. laughs> so we've got a French one. I believe this one is from Tesco's. I think. Yes, it was. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Should we give it a whirl and see what it's got to offer? Yes. Uh, yes. Why not? <coughs> now this is because this I think it's going to be very interesting these next few because you don't really associate um, Pinot Noir as a budget wine. If you know what no. I mean, you, you almost automatically know that you're going to have to pay a little bit more um, for a Pinot Noir, and especially. French. I was going to say, it's always a double whammy because you don't associate cheap wine no. from France, do you? No, no, no. And um, we, we do know the price of this. We do know the price of this. Uh, which is? 449. 449. Yeah, 449. Which just in itself, 449. I know. Yeah. For any wine, for, but for a Pinot Noir. Yeah. But anyway, we well, should have a look. France. <laughs> yeah, so it's got that vibrant. Right. Yeah. yeah. <coughs> bright clear, bright clear, bright, 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 kind of purple colour. It's yeah. not none of these little brown tinted edges. No, no. <coughs> Looks like it's ready to drink. Let's give that a nose. Very light on the nose. Yeah, there's not much coming from that. Not it's not. No, it's not, is there? You may have to scratch around to. Uh, yeah, to get anything. It's not. Yeah. It's not obviously Pinot Noir, not obvious, you know, yeah, we've said before. Foresty floor smell. Yeah, and it really does come out. It's, it's very easy to pick out on a, you know, like, like when you're blind tasting. That doesn't. No. Not really going much anywhere with that, but let's have a little. Yes, yeah, a little taste. taste. Okay, so. It's definitely got more, more on the flavour there. Yeah, much more. Uh, I, you know, from that nose there, I wasn't expecting much, but it has actually come through quite a lot. Still, though, I have to say, not very Pinot Noir esque. Yeah, it's like, yeah, it's, it's yes, I know what you're saying. And it's, it's very light, isn't it? It's quite mm. refreshing. Mm. Um, certainly, you would say a, a table wine would be ideal for, for quaffing. Yeah, I can't, yeah, yeah. From taste, no, you, you can get the, the kind of cherry flavour. Yep. Which you associate with, with your Pinot Noir, but it's not much after. It's quite, quite for for a lighter wine. It's quite heavy on the tannins there. Mm. I don't, as I said before, I don't like the tannins in there, and there's not a lot of power of wine to take on the tannins in there. But if you, as you're saying, for a table wine, that would be pretty ideal. I, yeah. I wouldn't. Oh, yeah, I mean, immediately, you know, the, the, it hasn't got much length. Mm. While it's in your mouth, it's very nice. It's very mm. refreshing. It's quite juicy. Yeah. yeah. Um, and you say you can get the cherry. Mm. Um, so, it's, it's not one of those sophisticated wines that you you know you, you get lots of different tastes from, is it? It's, it's, no. it's, it's one here, but very refreshing. I mean, you know, no one's no one's going to complain. You know, being given a glass, they're not going to go, oh, no. this is this is this is awful. It's, it's four forty nine. Exactly, it's brilliant value for four forty nine. It, it is. Oh. Mm. But if you're a fan of Pinot Noir, I probably wouldn't. No, no, mm. it's it's a nice wine. It's no Pinot Noir. No. That's what not, I said. Not as you know it. No, 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 no. Not as you know it, Captain. 
<laughs> no, no, I don't know. But I mean, I'm saying that. I mean, look, you know, I've almost slugged on mine, so. Yeah, yeah. You Even can't be go- that bad. No, no. You can't be that bad. Mm-hmm. 4 49 as a nice table wine. Yeah. That's right. But if you are looking for a nice Pinot Noir, I'd steer away from that. So, so far. If you were looking for just a light red, um, you know, not, not too heavy, something just to, to, to quaff and enjoy. Like, oh, easily, yeah. Eat, yeah. And, and at that price. Yeah. Take a good chill as well, out. Do you want to get any more out of the glass? <laughs> That's the auction. Um, uh, 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 no, if you, were to, uh, if you were to chill that, I think that might be a little bit nice as yeah. well. Yeah, I, th- I think that would take a chill well. Okay. Mm, might improve it. Good. All right. Okay. Well, we'll move on to our next one, uh, our next budget Pinot Noir, and see what that one's like. I think this one is from South Africa. Yes, it is, yeah. Okay. See you in part two for that one. Chin chin. Chin chin. <laughs> 